Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Shogun Showdown, a wonderful turn-based combat strategy roguelike that I'm very excited to be checking out again here today. Before I get into it, I want to say a huge thank you to Goblins Publishing for sponsoring this video, which is extra exciting because I played it a year ago when it was just a browser game and I really loved it. Said it was one of my most anticipated roguelike releases, and here we are checking out the early access a little bit early, which is already cool. So in we go to see more Shogun Showdown. In we are. If you're seeing this for the first time, you are in for an absolute treat. So moving, so we can turn around with W, we can move left and right. It is going to be kind of like a turn-based tactics game, except we're locked on a 2D grid, which may sound restrictive, but it is really, really clean. All right, so yeah, we can move, turn around, yada, yada. Uh, we can also use the scroll wheel, apparently. I mean, hey. Uh, there is an attack cue, so we can click and drag our attacks above our head like so. And that's going to be how we basically queue up and do our attacks, obviously. Space will let us do said attack going from bottom to top. So we would do a swirl, which is in like a melee swipe, and then an arrow. Whoop, whoop. And then... Oops. Defeat the dummies to proceed. So here's the thing. It is not going to be just as simple in the future as just going for like a, you know... Smack, 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 obviously. You will, you will see. Combat is turn-based, so performing one of the following actions will trigger a turn. Moving, turning around, adding a tile to the attack queue, or pressing the attack button. Got info mode, so we can kind of like hover over stuff and learn more about it. Defeat the enemy to proceed. So you can see now as we move, as we put things in, it is starting to actually be a problem. And another thing, they're being very generous with the cooldowns. Normally, these will take a while before we can use them again. So waiting, we can press S to wait a whole turn. There's some situations where doing nothing is the best play. Waiting for a cooldown, etc., etc. You can rearrange or remove tiles from the queue without triggering a turn. Now defeat these enemies to continue. Okay. So we can do this. And the thing is, since we have both these in the queue, we can go for a boom, boom. And triggering both actions only takes one turn. So we'll do this. And now we actually kind of want to wait. And then we'll go for the bang. Bang. Because we get to act first. After using a tile to attack, it'll take some turns to recharge before it can be used again. Defeat these dummies to proceed. So we're going to go for that. It looks like they kind of gave us a, uh, a free turn. So like it can be in our best interest to actually bait out an attack like this. And then move back. Wait for him. Bang. Bang. You can swap positions with an enemy by moving towards it while facing it. It has a four-turn cooldown. Practice your swap ability to proceed. Shwoop. I mean, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get hit as a result. I thought that maybe it was just like <laughs> literally just do it and then you're fine. Okay. Good. Good. Let's scoot on in. Alright. Let's go. In we go to an actual run here. So the thing that's going to be extra spicy about the game is the fact that we get these tiles. They have three kind of little modifier slots, and we can change them up quite a bit. And we'll draft out new tiles, things like that, over the course of a run as well. Quests. Okay, good. They changed the name of this, so it doesn't say... It used to say meta progression, but it literally... It was kind of misleading. All right. So those are tiles we can eventually unlock. There are going to be three characters in the early access. We're just going to be going with the Wanderer right now because it's the only one we have unlocked. And then you also unlock more options as you play. To the Bamboo Grove. I, I don't know if it's clear. I'm so excited for this. Just ever since I played that demo on itch.io, I've been itching to play this. No pun intended. Whoop. So this should be pretty clean to just go for a one-two punch on you. Let's adjust some audio. All right. Okay, so... I feel like this guy does, like, a dash, which... No, he's not. Okay. He attacks both in front of and behind him, so, like, if I tried to move into him, it would have been a problem. This has the lowest cooldown. We'll just go for this. 
Oh, perfect. Got a combo. We actually get a little bit more money that way. Gain a shield. Gonna try and bait out another wave. It's not really gonna work. Couldn't get a combo on that. We're gonna want to make sure we bait it right here, because otherwise we're gonna be trapped soon. Okay. And then we'll go for another melee into arrow. Good, we get a combo. Mass ice. Freeze all enemies for three turns. Strike the first target ahead, strike the first target ahead. So this does one damage, but it has a lot more kind of like malleability to it. There's four slots where I can put stuff. Shadow dash. Dash forward through all of the targets, stopping at the first empty cell behind them. If there's no empty cell behind them, no effect. Hmm. They're both quite malleable, though. I'll go for a shadow dash. Let's, let's play around with it. I think zipping through can be quite fun. You are a dirty devil. Hmm. So this is a... Okay, so we can actually go into it. Dash forward and strike the first target ahead. Unfortunately, we're going to maybe need to... Are you going to move towards me? He did not. So I actually don't want to use this. It'd be a waste. Alright, probably in my best interest to kind of like... Cool it for a turn or so. Bait this out. Hmm. If we get a combo, if we kill two in the same turn, we get a little bit more value, and that could be really, really clean for us. If we go for this, we can dash through, do a damage. Two, arrow. Pretty nice combo. And then this guy's really not a problem. We can, we can bait him out without even having to worry about it. Interesting stuff there. How do I deal with that? Let's wait for you to do something. Maybe we can have them all move. Dude, it's gonna suck. <laughs> can I... For science... I know it says it does nothing. Okay. That was just like... Does it mean it doesn't do the movement? Or does it do... Does it not do the other? Okay, so that's good to know. Unfortunately, they're in kind of a weird spot where I sort of feel like I need to... Yeah. They're they're being annoying. They're not really, like... They're taking their turns. Which is not great. Okay, here we go. So we'll go for the move. Whoop, whoop. There's a double. We'll take that. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to take this hit... Unless I do something else, because I can't... This is me trying to um, move my position into that guy. It just doesn't really work for us. This can go away. For three turns, you say? He doesn't have his attack queued up back here, so we should be fine. Yeah, okay. So here's a couple things. He is going to do the dash no matter what. He's not going to move forward towards me or anything. I think I'm just going to have to do this and then back up. I'm going to say no combo for me. Kind of just wanted to bait him out there. Alright. Okay. If we... If we can get them to move in towards us, that would be ideal. Okay. So we dash, we go for the... Whoop, 
We attack both of them, front and behind, and then we shoot out the arrow. I'll take a triple. I'll take a triple. Plus one damage, but also plus one cooldown. We could re-roll it. Shadow Dash is an okay one. We can also... Yeah, I mean, I think I'm fine with it. Potentially, we could do two damage to, like, everybody. Wander versus Daisuke the Dasher. I don't know what kind of attacks you have right now. You're going for a summon. I mean, presumably, yes, a dash he has, but... Huh. And then the dash will go all the way. So we go for arrow, dash through, attack on both. I think we might... Oh, lucky us. I was going to say, we were going to be forced to... Um... Okay. Let's go for the dash into the attack. So we actually move there. Attack behind us nice and clean. Let's go for summon. Nope. Same deal. Arrow, dash through, attack backwards. We're in an awkward spot now, so we're going to want to probably... Okay, we have to move through, just in case he decides that, yeah, you know what, that attack's just fine. And not go for anything else. Oh, shoot. Do we kill? Oh, wait, right-click fires? I did not know that right-click fired. Idiot. Eh. Air will do it. We'll get him out of there. Minus one cooldown. Being able to do our swipe more often is nice, but reducing the cooldown on the Shadow Dash, also good. I think we're going to... Let's lower the cooldown on this. Every other turn is pretty spicy. Max level upgrade and warring shop. Sacrifice tile. Sacrifice tile and guarding shop. I get a max level upgrade. I think that makes it so something can, you know, have an extra slot in it. Gain an extra consumable slot. Permanently unlock a skill slot to this shop. Sure. Sniper. Plus one damage when attacking from a distance of four tiles or more. It's not bad. I'm going to max level upgrade on that. It sounds fun. Let's go ham with that. Plus one damage, four cells or more. I mean, that, that's pretty specific. I don't know if it applies from the dash or not. I'll tell you what. Let's just get it. And I'll say no to the consumable slots. I don't typically use a lot of consumables anyways in this game, from what I've noticed. I'm sure... So the uh, the early access is going to have apparently four ascension levels, though, so... Oh! Oh, he's got a two-range attack. Okay, we actually... We got a wee bit of a problem. Never mind, he's dumb. <laughs> oh my god, okay. So we... I forgot that we can bait them... Wait, so four tiles or more? One, two, three, four. So we're gonna have to be here? This is for science. Yeah, okay. That was literally just for the science of it.
Yeah, I got bodied by that spawn. Do I at least dash for it? This is, again, for science. Nope. Just a huge waste. Good. Thank you for killing your friend. I really would love for you both to move towards me, but I think... I think that they're not really going to be doing that. So I'll just... I'll just say sayonara to you. Try and bait this out. You really just... You love just doing that. Okay, so I'm going to have to uh, get the kill on you. And he's not going to move. He's a lancer. This is unfortunate, though, because he's going to be dashing. So I think what we do is... Move through. Do we have time to rotate? We do. That was a tight one. We had it. Screw you. Zoop. Obliterated. New tile type. Sword, strike the cell directly ahead. Or another arrow, hopefully going for, like, the sniper angle. Sword doing a exceptionally low cooldown. So literally every turn we could do we could do sword. But it, the thing is, it takes two turns to do it anyways because of the cooldown and the fact that it takes a turn to put it in. Arrow synergizes better with the sniper angle, so I'll go for it. Which... Sniper angle plus the other thing. Oh, wait. The, the map got a little bit bigger. Okay. How do I get him? Okay, I can move here. I could get him to kill, but he's not going to be turning his moves yet. Like, he, he's turning, and then he places the tile, and then he readies it. They're going to put their tile, and they're going to move and ready it. So... Do they know? Interesting. Not quite the way I... Th yeah, not quite the way I thought that was going to go. Bad, bad ordering, bad ordering. I thought that they were going to both move at the same time, which meant I would have been able to get a double kill off of the dash, or kill off the dash and get the escape. I should have um, readjusted as soon as I knew, though. Well, it was basically who dies first there. I'm just going to take a moment of respite. That's an exceptionally easy one there, at the very least. Eh, already a little bit awkward here. Because they're not going to move. These guys are really stuck in the corner. I'm just kidding. I see there's already a thing on the ground. I'll, let's just pop, pop that there. Dash through AoE. I mean, it's something. We do the two. Then we get things on cooldown already. That's not good.
Okay. What do you do? I actually don't know if I know you. You're kind of ruining my plans. I could get two, like, really good snipes off otherwise. One, two, three, four. I'll take it. I'll admit I want to know if this counts as an attack from four tiles away. But I'm in a bad spot if I'm wrong. Well, so I'm not going to... I don't want to take extra dumb damage. Plus one max level up. I mean... I'm actually going to re-roll this. Two cooldowns already pretty good. Wanderer versus Iwao, Iwao, the Impaler. I'm assuming that's going to be a long-range vibe. Strike at distance two ahead and beyond, behind. Three, three, dash through. All right, you ready? Shoot. Boop. All right, should be fine. One, two, one, two, three, four. gonna be the an impaler oh you didn't move jerk I thought that guy would have moved zoop let him go back and get the three and the three get out of here punk the sniper's coming in quite a bit handy. Free play plus three cooldown. Would exceed max cooldown. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. A free arrow. That's kind of spicy. I'll do it. I'll say yes. Crazy cooldown now. <laughs> cooldown upgrade, combo shop, sacrifice a tile, warring shop. Sure thing, man. Combo kills, recharge the cooldown of the, to the tile, dealing the killing blow. The shop upgrade here. Why not? Minus one cooldown. So yeah, minus cooldowns now on the free tile are, like, exceptional. Suffer four. on sale for two i'm sell if i sell it for four and you're selling it for two i can literally sell it back for profit <laughs> i'm not gonna moonlit port don't mind if i do this is new to me okay we got clearly an arrow Hmm. We'll take that. I 
I'm just gonna say yes at this point to that move and say, okay, same deal here. We'll just rip through. Shield on the ground. Not a lot to do there. Okay, hold on. Love to see that. Love to see that. Hold on. This is a triple. Bonk. Shoop. Bonk. Now that's not a position you like to be in, though. That's for sure. We might have to kind of just go for it. Lest we... Yeah, let's just go. We're, we're just going for it. A little bit more positioning. We got the Mr. Arrowman. Shoop, shoop. It's not four tiles away, unfortunately. And we, yeah, we can't get him to back up. Too long of a cooldown to. Is it too long of a cooldown just to throw out there? Maybe not. It kind of puts us into a um, a nice spot. Go for this. At least it would have been if we could have locked him in place. Here. He'll back up. Cool. Obliterated. Minus cooldown. Another minus cooldown. I, on a free action, like, let's get that as low as possible. Yeah. This is a very small... One, two, three, four... We need to be, like, on the max distance away. I think throwing these out immediately is actually not bad. Get that cooldown on the freebie going. Yes, <laughs> this is tight. <laughs> we can maybe bait out. We can probably bait out a spear attack, though, if we stay here. But last, we cannot stay here. I must go. Coming to get you. I had to come to get you. Rip through. Attack. These guys are tougher to combo. Like, could we get combos on them? Yeah. Am I largely wanting to? No. Kind of just buying a little bit of time for some cooldowns. Idiot. Um. Whoosh. Slap, kill, kill. That's a nice clean double. about the combo on that one. I think I just want to get us moving. This guy, when he's alone, is literally he's nothing. Cut. Obliterated. Next. Plus one damage. That one's maxed out. I think getting this upgrade sounds good. Three. 
That opens up a lot of different combo opportunities for sure. One, two, three, four. The fact that... Wow. One, two, three, four. I don't know, dude. I kind of like the idea of dashing through, but that sort of messes up everything I just did then. <laughs> He's going to ready up his shot next turn, so it's kind of just like one, two, three. He's moving towards me. Yeah. That was just a mistake. I thought we were going to... I was like, yeah, I'll move this position here. But I cannot do that. So I guess we'll just prep this to get the heal. That is what I wanted right there, but dude, you got to stop. Go for the heal in case a potion drops. Attack, attack, attack. It's free action. Should we do it? Probably. Mm, not yet, though. We want to make sure we're not in uh, range of that guy. Oh. Wait. Dash through? Oh, my God. This, this is all we need. Yeah, give him the arrow. <laughs> I think that one we just sort of want to get out of there. He will move towards us pretty much no matter what here. If we're looking for a combo, we kind of have to bait them out like this. I don't want the kill because then I can't get the combo. There we are. Clean enough. Got some distance to us now. I think this guy might just keep on moving towards us anywho. Hmm. We got our dash. We could do like a... We could get a double already. Whoop, whoop. I don't mind that. If if he we wait a turn and he moves, then we are a little out of luck. Okay. Archer immediately behind me, a little bit a little bit cringe. Okay, hold on. You've gotta move towards me. You in fact do not gotta move towards me. Alright. Dash, kill, free arrow. Hot. Plus one damage. At this point? At this point? I don't know. I don't know which one would be better. The dash is great for combos, but it's not that great for bosses. I feel like this is technically the most, like, DPS, per se. Oh! I don't actually know what these guys do. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Sort of ideal. Oh, that was a mistake. I don't think we should have turned around. Worked out fine, but we should not have done it. What is that? Dash forward as far as possible. Oh, God. He's going for a double. Swap the content of the cell directly ahead and behind. That doesn't really seem like that big of a deal. Am I crazy? Yeah, I was gonna say, it doesn't imply that it does damage. Uh, I think they have the exact same health bar. So this should be fine. Attack, dash through. Oh, well, arrow first, I guess. Just move through. Arrow. I guess melee. You doing that same thing, huh? There's really no problem with that. This, like, the fact that it doesn't do damage means it just doesn't matter. Oh, you get a free combo for that. That's nice. Dash backwards and strike the first target behind you. Dash forward and strike the first target ahead. I feel like backward charge, considering we have shadow dash, backward charge is a bit better. It's also a, a tile I've never seen before. Sacrifice a tile for 40 coins. When you perform a combo kill, a random enemy is cursed. I don't know what that means, but I will indeed do it. Combo shop upgraded. Sure. Blood service reroll and restock the shop. Heal one health when executing a triple combo. Sure. For five coins, I could just... now oh, whatever. Wait. Gain five coins for two health. This heal... Wait. Wait. Game the system, baby. It's called business, sweetheart. Spirit gateway. I have no idea what you do, but I'm assuming it looks like it's going to be some kind of a maybe a, a grapple. So I'm just going to... Act under that assumption for now. Huh. <laughs> I just don't... Yeah, I don't really know. I don't... Wish I didn't turn around, I guess. Pull the first target to the cell directly ahead. Okay. Bolt. A little overkill. A little awkward. <laughs> uh... There we go. Whew. Well, that's going to hurt. He's been cursed. I don't... Again, I don't know what that means yet. He is going to pull me... I, I needed those guys as protection. Matter. 
take that too. That's fine. We do get to blow this guy up. Hmm. Wait, why'd that do... Cursed enemies take double damage. Gotcha. Uh, we won't be able to dash through if we... One, two, three, four, five, four, one, two, three. This is probably fine. Anything else would have been a little messy. Whoop, whoop. Okay, I love that move. That's fun in there. Are you a spearman? You're not the spearman. You're the uh, hit side to side. Or no, you're just hit in front. I could bait out his attack. I could bait out his attack and get a pretty easy double. Could also do the dash, and then we go. Whoop, whoop. I like that they're coming in, both coming in close. And I don't really want to turn around, so I think we do. Swoop, boop, and then for kicks and wiggles. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's so good. That's so good. I don't know why I did that. All right, there we go. Wanted to bait out the AOE there. Dash through four arrow. Okay, because we need to get that guy in one, basically. Plus one max level. Can you do this? You can. Do we have... Is this the final zone? If this is the final zone, then we don't care. I don't know if it is or not. There it is. It tells me. There, there's the thing that tells me what they they take. Gotcha. Surely we don't need swirl every turn. Surely not. Smile. Okay. Four and four. Don't know what you do. I mean, assume I don't like it. Especially because... Yeah, you're a spearman. One, two, three, four. Ah. Eh. Oh, okay. You throw a shuriken. Okay. 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 All right. Lesson learned on that one. You throw a shuriken. I, I suppose I could have pieced it together from the shuriken in your hand that you probably just used the shuriken attack. It's not really that big of a deal. I'm trying to think about combos. I'll just take the one. Whatever. As far as combos go, I don't know. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Let's just get that guy out of the way. Okay, you are always going to be a problem. I'll take a double. That guy is cursed.
sure. I would love a dash through. Boop, swoop. Kabump. <laughs> Dumb. Dumb, but I love it. Okay. Got another little son of a gun. Dash through seems not bad. Into the... You're going to move toward... Towards me, maybe? This nets us a double kill. Wait. So does this, but this nets us a double kill. Wait. Whoop. Swoop. A oh, swoop, whoop. This is unnecessary. But if I can, wait, if I can get the double kill first. I could also just move you here and you die. If I get the double kill first, then we got ourselves a good situation, but I don't... Because then we can maybe... I don't think it's happening. I think just accepting this is already fine. Man's cursed. Shoot. Should move closer. Uh, does he move back? He never. He never moves back. Okay, so you are absolutely at the ready immediately. That's awkward. If we pop on the curse, this is a triple kill. Let's just do it. For kicks and wiggles. It's just too good looking. Oh, and there was a curse on the ground anyways. Plus one damage, plus one cooldown. I certainly don't care about the cooldown on this one, but the question is, like, do I care about damage either? I don't know. I'm using Shadow Dash a lot. You know what? For the sake of curiosity, what else we got? Minus four cooldown, minus one damage. That's silly. That's on a one-turn cooldown. It doesn't do as much damage, but being on a one-turn cooldown is hilarious. I don't know why I wanted to do it that way. It just sounded fun. I guess that's the why. Me he <laughs> Yeah, you gotta go. Um, hmm. Could pretty easily bait out a shuriken going into his back, I guess. Is there any curse potions on the ground? Not that I see. Alright. Yeah, he kind of he kind of just inserts himself. Zoop. Boop. Whoop. Love it. Dash through into the AoE is already good. No, got the wrong wrong dash. <laughs> wrong short-term dash. Okay, we're throwing. I mean, we're not really. 
Like, there's no problem with anything that's happening. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay. We, we're just not getting as much combo, which may or may not even do anything for us. Deal. More largemen. I mean, it's already a kill, but... We could like, okay, hold on. We could bait him into attacking here, because I think it goes left to right. But we would go. Swoop. Swoop, boop. No, if I, wait, if I go swoop, boop, then he dies, which is actually not good. <laughs> Weirdly enough. If I do this now, I don't know, man. We, we can. Okay, I don't like that. We don't want to be on the other side. All right. Let's be boring. All right. Now a swoop boop is okay. Swoop boop. Kadoop. We got a couple couple weirdos here. Eh. The backup slam. It's actually terrible for us in hindsight. Okay, if we ro if we rotate, then we can go It'll be. It'll not really be what I wanted. The backup slam will give us the three damage on the uh, the big man at the very least. It's an out. It's weird. Like that. That's pretty cool. Setting that. Oh, I didn't think you were actually going to be ready immediately. Well, good on you. Congratulations. Uh, there's a potion on the ground for me, anyways. Thanks. Kill an enemy from eight tiles away. Minus one cooldown. We can pop that on... Dude, I don't know at this point. I guess just the arrow. Do I really need that on a lower cooldown? What else you got? What, are, what other cool things are here? Plus one damage, plus one cooldown. Absolutely worth doing on that one. The Wanderer versus the Statue. Wait, what the hell? You Wait, you have health down there? That's different? Okay. I will take that arrow, unfortunately. It, the fact that they are on the end tiles. Oh, well, I guess maybe depending on how the summon goes. Oh, you're still trying to summon something else. Okay. 
Okay, ding dong. Um, certainly if I do this, you're going to want to chase me down to hit me with the melee attacks, right? Otherwise, you waste both of those, which seems stupid. No, yeah, okay, no, you're just, it's just stupid then. That's fine. Okay, so now, okay, if I can get you away from the wall, that'd be amazing. Summon to you. What is that? Strike the cell directly ahead for four. You got some random stuff, my guy. This is just what you do, huh? You just... I'm gonna swing my arms wildly, and if you get in the way, that's on you! What's that? Strike at a cell, at the cell at distance two ahead. Do I kill you in five damage? Because, like, if I turn around, I do the whatever, whatever. It's kind of awkward. Yeah, I guess it just... I mean, sure, you do you. You go ahead, you attack those tiles. The second you get a dash or something, there's an arrow. The arrow is the problem, if anything. Wild. Spear. Wait, we get we still get attacks? How much more is there? Strike the two cells ahead. Piercing. I mean, I'll say sure. I may end up ditching that. You can only do so many. Cooldown upgrade, damage upgrade, and guarding shop. Sure. Begin fights with a shield, but minus two max HP. Plus two max HP. <laughs> sure, sure. Plus one damage shrine is nice, though, for just for 20 bucks. Just straight up. Hot springs. Hmm. Don't know what you do. Give a shield to the first shieldless ally ahead. What if there is none? I mean, I have a shield already, so... We can't just yoink, yoink it from him. Back up. Foom, foom. Foom, foom. Foom. Love to see that. Got the clean dash through. You're going to try and do that, aren't you? Yeah. next turn. So we go for the boom, boom, so we can get you out of the way now. We can obviously back up there nice and clean. Little poka poka. Eh. The ninja, I'm kind of just like, 
Let him perish. We could try and go for a, a clean combo of it or, or something, but... Mayhaps a mistake in order in this, basically. This this being unnecessary. Nope, not being unnecessary. Bye. Next. Minus cooldown. Still we're getting minus cooldown. I think taking some more arrows feels pretty good on that. Alright, just a big man. Another big man. Zoop. Pretty much have to go for those on those guys. We can't move through, can we? No. Ooh. What is that? Swap position with the target ahead. It's not that big of a deal, but the area is just so tight here that I don't want to mess. Lol. I love this, like, rapid-fire business that's going on here. It's actually really cool. Um, I'm just going to assume. Shoop, whoop. Good assumption. I was like, what's probably just going to be the best thing for us? And I was right. And get a double here nice and easy. But then we are open. Well, we have a barrier. And then also we have the freebie. Because he got cursed to take the double damage. Plus one damage, plus one cooldown. We can absolutely afford to do this on something we've got. I think a three damage arrow is not a bad call. Like, making it so it's four at a distance. Spear could obviously be cool too, but I think this is worth it. From claustrophobic area to a large zone. Weirdness on that one. Got the arrow on the big boy. Uh, arrow on the big boy shall kill, but you are the cursed um, spearman. That was silly. That was that was silly. <laughs> um, man, got the pull guy as well. If we get the combo, that is nice. These two guys being on the very far ends is really really rough though. This is going to be like a we would take a shuriken, though. 
Unless we got a combo, which we would not get. Boom, boom. We wouldn't get a combo. We can't have a fourth thing in here. I think this is fine, though. Because, like, I don't want to... This guy's the more important one to kill because he gets a double. And we do have a shield, like, as annoying as it is to lose it. It just doesn't really matter. He's going to go for it. Got the double, but there's not much I can do. I was hoping for the arrow. Well, I guess we could do it this way. Because we might get the combo kill here, and you get cursed, and you take the five. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. This I'm kind of just wanting to set up a, a spicy, spicy triple. But he's so... Locked in place. You jerk. Well. And then, yeah, and then now that we got the shield, too. He's going to do it again. But they can't have, as far as I'm aware... No, okay. So you be prepping this. We go for the dash. Swipe. Yeah, the arrow is unnecessary in that moment. Same deal here. I don't want to lock myself in the corner, so I'm just going to... Oh, screw you. Him getting a shield is very annoying. Do I take him out? I think I just take him out. We can't deal with the big man. Top it. Okay, so be Pierce. Whoop. Unnecessary overkill, but still. Gotta love it. One, two, three, four. You jerk. We're not using this. We really could just ditch this at some point here. Slap that in. Well, uh, I kind of like the idea of the mass curse for the triple here now. Because we otherwise we slight beefed it. Me too. Me too. Minus cooldown. I'm not really needing that right now. Shockwave. Upon hit, if other enemies are adjacent in adjacent cells, a shockwave spreads, dealing one damage to each. I don't know if I want to have three cooldown on it as a result. We'll try this, because there's a chance it, like, kind of double taps there. I like that a lot. Um, and then we'll hit you with the dinky one. 
maybe that depending on how the order of operations goes there I, I thought there was maybe a chance it would take less damage I'll lock you in there arrow man I'm gonna have to care wait now I don't have to care you jabroni All right, shall I? Oh, I beefed it at the end there. But good news is, as far as I'm aware, it is irrelevant here. And that is a kill. Plus one max level. I mean, like, look for something, look for something max out. I guess I will go for this. Because apparently these runs are going, they just keep going on, man. Can execute your special move swap, even if you're not facing your enemy, but it gets plus one cooldown. That does sound really nice for what it's worth. Poison, but plus two cooldown. Poison enemies take one damage at the end of the turn for three turns. Turning that into a poison move is actually pretty cool. Free money. Okay, I think we might be actually schmoovin' to the end here. Ten waves. Hmm. Three of these on the same turn is something. <laughs> Highly goofed. Oh, you've got a dash. Okay. That sucks. Well, bring it on then, I guess. We've we've really um we really goofed this one. So do that, we got a problem. If I do this, theoretically, you take three damage, but that's not going to be enough, Then I can't do this backwards. I should have just never not put this one in. Back up, I still take damage. But I could do, like, back up, I take damage, but at least this guy's also taking damage and getting trapped in here, which I think is going to be in my best interest. Solved the bit there. We've got potions all over the floor that we can't do anything with, so we really should just be using them more anyways. Okay. A lot of turns before I could use that one up there. Oh, and when they're cursed, they take even more from the poison. Good to know, good to know. 
Uh, this guy is a son of a gun. I'm going to go for this potion since there's the poison on the ground. Low. 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 I think we might need to... Oh, wait, turn around. Hold on. I thought it would take an extra turn. Still yet another potion on the ground. There's just so many. I kind of want to stay here. Okay, we got behind us. Yeah, that guy does a dash. So go whoop, boop. I mean, technically, in a way, it's better for us if we don't kill. It's silly, but it's it's I just want to watch this one in action. Okay, and then we actually get trapped in the corner, which genuinely is, I think, usually better, which is sort of funny. Hot. Yep. Got potions all over the floor. I guess I could just freeze them. Get another potion. It's already good. Stinking ninja. They're weirdly the one that uh, probably causes the most problems, right? Just because I don't want to take one damage. I know it's not a lot, but... Yeah. As it's getting later in the run, I'm just throwing out more dumb moves. Free play, but plus three cooldown. Absolutely. Fine by me. Hideyoshi, the cunning. Who knows? What is that? Mirror the attacker's position on the field. Wait, dash backwards? Mirror... Mirror their position. Wait, okay. Weird. I don't like the... But we can also, like, just... Strange. Okay. So, you're gonna... You're gonna rotate... Wait, you're gonna rotate to do the backwards charge. Rotate, and then you're gonna go back all the way. Mirror, do an attack for two away. Is that a problem for me? Unless I'm... Mirror its own position on the field. Gotcha. Mirror its own. That makes way more sense, like, from a strength standpoint. 
two enemies. Zoop. What the hell's that? Teleport to the center of the field, exchanging positions with a target if present. So you're gonna die. This doesn't help me. I just did that because like we might as you might as well, right? Okay. Oh, okay. Wait. So hold on. So if we move here, you're gonna we're gonna change positions, and then you're gonna do that. Gotcha. This guy's wacky. Um, you know what? We might want... It's kind of interesting. It's not quite what I wanted. But getting the ninja out of the way actually sounds quite nice. Sounds really nice, in fact. This guy's a strange man. Strange, strange man. Dash forward as far as possible. Place a bomb on the cell directly ahead. It detonates after two turns and then dash <laughs> backwards. And the adjacent. So, do I. Am I not even taking damage or. I'm confused by you, my man. And then you're going to dash back as far as possible. Two turns, it said? Strike directly ahead and behind. Mirror. Go over here. Strike directly ahead and behind. That doesn't matter to me. Kind of hoping for one there. Oh, well. I don't think I'm actually going to be able to, um, unless I pop this. So we could go boop, 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 and a kill. Dash all the way, mirror the position. Oh, you do try and hit me. Dash all the way backwards, mirror position. So, does that work? Can you can you do that? You can. This is a. I love this fight, as bizarre as it is, and it is very bizarre. I think we can actually just maybe... This is go to the center. Yeah. Strange man. All right, this has got to be the final. Holy. Not a short run. Shockwave and plus one cooldown. I mean, considering, we might probably might as well, right? Uh, we'll buy this. Sure. Special move swap inflicts a damage. 
Eh. I also don't know if I care about this. I, I guess I'll... Plus one cooldown on it as well. It's just kind of like... I actually think both of those... Make things a little bit worse for me. We've gotten quite strong, which is understandable. This is a little bit more weird. I don't know what to do. We don't want to kill both of those because then we're forced to take that hit. Ninjas here. Uh. Oh boy. This might work. Does that count as a combo? It sure do! Why not? Got dash man. They are n relentless. Ah, uh, boy. Howdy. Spear on those guys is probably going to be the way to go. This guy is annoying behind me. So he's going to do the pull. Just if I go whoop, whoop. It's just, we're going to be forced to take a hit if we... Yeah, yeah. Okay, hold on. I don't think I want to do that yet. I don't think I want to... Eh. They've really... They put me in between a rock and a hard place here. I think mass poison actually might go a long way for us at this point. Poison should work. Oh, my lord. We don't know what's coming, so we can't really, like, super process it. Large smack. That sounds good. We can do... Uh... it we also could do this a little bit of a combo big man behind me a little bit annoying he's gonna do the pull and he's gonna be able to get it off so Thank you for the help. Wave nine. Dash through. 
Oh, that's hot. Oh, that's hot. Okay. One, two, three, one, two. Good, good. Not bad. Double strike plus four cooldown. It's not that it's not good. I just can't justify it. A free attack. I think we're going to have to go for it. Cooldown reduction on a free attack sounds lovely. It's the Shogun Showdown. Gang, I think this may be the fight. that strike the cell directly ahead pushing the target back as far as possible deal collision damage if another target's in the path so obviously we could like just do that oh son of guns got a dash That's some pain. I think we'll get him while he's four away here. He has no intent of moving backwards again. Okay. Weird man, weird man, weird man. Okay, if we back up, I don't know if we can even... I don't even know if we can hurt these things. Look kind of like we can. Not bad. I don't like him taking that position there. But we can kind of use this guy behind me. What is this? Mirror. I don't know who goes first. I go here. Oh, I thought that... I just, I had the, the center point wrong. I think maybe claiming this now is a good call when we can do the eight. Just feels like a good use of time. You really got it all, don't you? I mean, while we have you where we want you, I think we just go for it, man. But then you're coming in. Well, that's okay, actually. Sort of. And then you're... Sh now you're shielding, too? Let's just do lots of damage while we can. So we can... Move position in. We get a little bit of a back smack. Yeah. We're, we're playing a little too fast and loose here. That could kill, but here's the thing. He's dead. He's dead. We, we could have done that way better. Yeah, okay. He's not dead. Checks out. Teleport to the center. I don't like the sound of that. Unleash a growing ring of expanding outward by a cell each turn. Ha ha Okay. So this is actually kind of good for us. Also, sure.
You're aiming to dash backwards as far as possible. Same. Dash backwards as far, far as possible, and then mirror. I mean, but why? I don't know what you gained from that, but I'll say okay. Um, I kind of think that we are... It's really annoying, but we should probably just take the shuriken. Like, what else can I... I can't do anything about it. I thought that he would, you know, maybe do something else. Where do you think you're going? So it starts by damaging right here. And then we can go whoop, whoop. Are you doing the weird back and teleport thing again? You sure as hell are. That one I don't get. That I I was I saw that one coming this time, my my boy. You going nowhere! Get out of here. Defeat the Shogun. That was not a short run whatsoever. <laughs> Defeated in less than a thousand turns. Combo master. Okay. Ultimate rank. Defeated on day. On day question mark. Swift. Yeah. You'd be sure. I'm sure you can. As you play more. You could go a lot quicker. But holy crap. Defeat the Shogun. Having received Seven hits or fewer over the course of the whole run. That one I could see being more possible, believe it or not, for me right now. Curse tile, grappling hook, knockback punch. I mean, let's, let's unlock some stuff, yeah. Get another grappling hook. Curse tile. Lightning. Get the bow. What is this? Just... Backwards strike. Smoke bomb. Did the dash. Just trying to get as many things as I can. Turn around. I... Sure? There we go. Holy mole. Did we get another... We did get another character. The Ronin can push an enemy in front of him by moving forward. Well, alas, alas, that is that. That's going to do it here for today for Shogun Showdown. I was not expecting such a long run, but I'm also, you know not upset that there's so much game here but holy holy crap we'd have to play more and get quicker with it because the uh you can be very strategic meaning you can take a long time per turn for the optimal thing but boy howdy we were as you saw we were starting to play a little bit quicker towards the end and we were actually starting to make a little bit more mistakes if we wanted to play that quick the whole round we probably would be done a lot quicker but we would also maybe have died probably not uh, very, very good. Very, very good. Very, very cool. I forgot we're doing a sponsor thing. So, so again, huge thank you to, uh, Goblins Publishing for sponsoring this video. Link at the top description. You want to check out the game for yourself. I'm probably going to play more of this if I'm going to be honest. Uh, so, hey, if you're interested, let me know in the form of a comment down below. Thank you for watching. Check out my channel for roguelikes and more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.